All right, welcome back to another episode of Daily Wrap-Up Crew. No book of, but I go by the name of Eli. As always, we got Ace with us. Yes, indeed. They said they want bars on my offer. It's the Valentine's Day show, and you know I'm chocolate. You heard? Oh, I'll have me Ace to go 24. Bro, like, this guy is, <laughs> like, yo, last but not least, we got Jew. Oh, since he think he poetic, let me drop some poetry. Let me see. Roses are red, violets are blue. Follow us on all platforms. Subscribe to us, too. And drop a dollar or two on our cash app, too. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Yo, we got some special guests in the uh, building. Ladies, let them know where they can follow you at. You can follow me on Instagram at tikagal.underscore. Okay. You can follow me at brown thundercat, brown underscore thundercat. Mm-hmm. My name is Imperia. And you can follow me at imperia.justine on Instagram. Okay. okay. Mm-hmm. But yeah, bring the mic, mic a little closer that way. You know what I mean? It's better. Yeah. yeah. Better. All right. So basically, you know, since this is a Valentine's Day themed, you know, we thought we'd do something special real quick. And, you know, yo, Weasel, you could bring that out real quick. Oh, shit. I like it. Mm hmm. I mean, mm-hmm. We, we, we try to be, we try to be gentlemen on the, on the show. Like, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? That's nice. There you go. Aww. Thank you. There you go. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Yep. Yeah, make sure y'all take that chocolate real quick. Yeah, I, y'all can put that on. Yeah. And make your ex mad. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Or current. Or, or, current. or, 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 or y'all can yeah. feed me a chocolate as well. You know what I'm saying? You can saying? take the whole box. Oh. I don't eat chocolate. Oh, you don't eat chocolate? Oh, oh man. Oh, I, See, I, I, eat eat I definitely eat chocolate too. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I love right. chocolate women. Mm-hmm. All right. So, um, get into this first topic. It says, what's the bare minimum for y'all for Valentine's Day? To receive or to give? Just the, yeah, both, I guess. Yeah. Let's, let's it depends on the, the situation. Receiving. Let's start with the receiving. If that's your man, then you know his situation. So mm-hmm. if he say he don't have nothing, mm-hmm. then you have to be okay with accepting nothing because it comes to times where a nigga might really not have nothing. Mm-hmm. But then, you know, if if you see that his pockets are right, then mm-hmm. you should definitely be expecting something. So if he ain't got nothing, he ain't got to draw a card or write he you a letter. Or nothing. Absolutely not. Maybe a little. No, I'm just kidding. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, what no, he do. Is, <laughs> he do. Get... It better be extra kinky that night, for real, oh, okay. or breakfast or something. Breakfast, breakfast, <laughs> yeah. okay. Okay. breakfast okay. bad. What, what about you? The bare minimum. Mm-hmm. That would have to be like a card. A like, card. Just a card only. Okay. That's the bare minimum. No flowers, just a card. It could be handwritten and I'd be from the store or nothing. Just a card, like from the store, handwritten, like nothing in the card. Okay. okay. Just an empty card. All right, look, I know you about <laughs> keep it real with us. Go ahead, go ahead. No, my birthday is two days um before Valentine's Day. So I'm usually planning for my birthday. We kind of put everything oh, for yeah. vacation. That's like a so cheap it's like yeah. Yeah. shout out to that it's nigga calm, that's scoop up. You yeah. save money. All right. <laughs> All right. So my next question is what's the most romantic thing y'all ever done? I'm going to be honest, nothing. Yeah, same. Nothing. I, well, I, I, go to I ain't going to hold you. That's why y'all gave these 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 line-ass answers, because I know ain't no way a nigga could just write y'all goddamn exactly, car and y'all I, accepted yeah, that. No. What you mean you never had a romantic Valentine's Like, I never, like, really celebrated Valentine's Day ever. Oh, you, you, know, you, know, like, you don't care about it? Like, no, I just never had a boyfriend or a partner that around that time. Oh, oh okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. All right, so what about you? Um... I, you got to show out now. They don't say they ain't do nothing. You got to at least have gave him a, a shot, draw him a bath or something. Like, oh, I, mean? I I feel like I've done more than draw him a bath. Like, okay. I feel like um, as far as Valentine's Day, as far as receiving, um, I want to say like, you know, a little vacation. It was short, like probably like to Vegas. You paid for a vacation? No. No, she said receiving. He oh, paid she, for Oh, okay, okay, okay. But another year, <laughs> I want to say previous, a few years previous, I put him. I actually put him on his feet for Valentine's Day. Like, but well, it was up. putting us. It was it was putting us on our feet for Valentine's. Well, he was Day. in a wheelchair. So, you, got him, you got him up by that. <laughs> no, I mean like um, investing in his business. Oh, okay. So I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't gonna hold you. I don't know. That's what happened. I don't know. That's what happened. That's what for Valentine's Day. It was but, either but y'all, y'all want rose petals, y'all want the, uh, you know, I mean the your dream come true that right. day. You get what I'm saying? Like we might it. have the wrong females on this panel because I don't think that's necessary for me. Yeah. 
Honestly, it's I not. don't really care about depending the, the, on your financial state. Mm. So don't, don't be in a deal really store. About- I care about financial state. I ain't even going to hold you. It, so if, if you were the dude and it's Valentine's Day and he like, yo, I ain't even got it right now. We we in the crib. You I'm not that? somebody who's big on like these holidays, these man-made holidays. But, Honestly. But you your get birthday's what I'm around saying? the time. So yeah, you know. So So if he like, yeah, we, can't, we can't do nothing for your birthday this year, then what? That's crazy. So that's so crazy. That's she, crazy. She, she cheating on that nigga for sure. Like, <laughs> I'm I'm like, like is, that, is that, it over? Is it over? I know that y'all all going to have the nigga is it, in the group is chat. It, is it over? Is the relationship over? Oh, he over? definitely going to be in the group birthday? chat. Yeah. That's yeah, tough. I never experienced that. Yeah. No matter what. I, mean, I don't you think the nigga's not going to do nothing yeah. for your birthday. <laughs> not in your taste, though. Right. Yeah, 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 that's true. Like, so do y'all feel like social media puts a lot of pressure on men? Because y'all saying... Yes. Y'all of course. Do... You know how many people repost Jada Waiter? Your nigga's not little baby. Yeah. Crazy. Mm. Like, they... Shit. She better look at that shit and imagine... Girls be getting Birkins, new cars, yeah, everything like ice. Look, how do how how would she expect me to buy her a Birkin and all she doing is twerking? Like that shit, it ain't matching up. It ain't the same. But I mean, girls that are twerking are still getting Birkins. We not getting nothing. There are girls that still twerk and don't do nothing and still get the Birkins though. Sure. Well, it's 2022. If you're not getting nothing in return for Valentine's Day, you you're just literally dealing with a female that's. Financially unstable. All right. But but real quick, real quick, do y'all think that do y'all think the majority of the women think Valentine's Day is only as a holiday only to celebrate them, them? Yeah, I heard yeah. guys say that. Okay. Definitely, it's a woman's holiday. So why? Well, well, I, I did a poll on my Instagram. I said, guys, what do you want? A lot of them said threesome, foursome. Y'all bring it back I, down to mm, sex. I, I do agree. I asked but... another guy. He said it's about a woman <laughs> Valentine's Day. Is he saying that's what the con- general consensus no, is? No, that's, that's what he it's feels. A like this, bro. Okay. I'm going to tell you why he's saying that. Because y'all rap that same pussy that we had all year, 365. Cool. Let's you get what I'm saying? So if so you're going to wrap that pussy up. He's going to want different pussy. I, I mean, no. Not, not different pussy. He still wants your pussy. He just want another one added. Nah, he want a different pussy. You know what it's saying. <laughs> oh, no, 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 but that's still different. I'm on just top saying, of like, it, you like... Just, y'all, y'all rap. It's my birthday. I get pussy. Christmas, I get pussy. Uh, Valentine's Day, I get pussy. To us, pussy is like, the bare minimum. Like, you know what I'm yeah, saying? That's like, the bare right, minimum. It is, it like, is, yeah. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't mind if you... I mean, y'all cook all the time. Uh, hopefully, some women cook for their man or whatever. But you cook... What would y'all like, come, though? What, would what you if like you get in pussy Sunday? in Jamaica? I, I mean, Does that change it up? That's cool. If I, if do, you, am I paying wait, wait, for Jamaica? Did you... Who paid for Jamaica, though? Me, of course. Because you get in pussy in Jamaica. Okay. I just said The same thing... The same thing... Not the flowers and the chocolate, obviously. But the same way I want vacations and shit, too. When it's special, that's that's the same thing. I All right, want, so can you speak for the man? What do y'all want? Right. If Valentine's Day was about you, what's what the ideal want? gift to get you? Where you can say, "My girl has outdone herself." Don't say outdone yourself, because what if men are really simple? I don't. I don't just want pussy though, like because pussy is just like that's just what everybody. I mean, I could, I'll take a love letter because that means yeah, you took time you to put your thought into it. You get what I'm yeah. saying? So yeah, men, men are so I, I, easy. They we, are. Y'all could just get us some cologne, Boxers like and socks, and I don't know about all of that, but I'm a, I'm something to more. show your appreciation. You, like, you know what I mean? Well, it means something to you, honestly, sentimental. Something sentimental would be like her. Even her making reservations for a restaurant. Like, that's something small. What like, else? You know, that's the big um, That's why I said, if you got a gamer, gamer dude, a little give him a getaway, PlayStation. Like, get a little hotel, game. like, out of state somewhere. Mm-hmm. Like, that's, that's I shit. Love, we, I love and getaways. drive from our house. And drive. <laughs> and drive. This is as simple as you driving. <laughs> like, like, that's an that, initiative to something. Yeah. You always got to drive, too. I feel like gamers are, like, the most easiest to... So for. What, what has been... I'm going to buy him VC. What has been the most sentimental or... Best gift that y'all have received for Valentine's Day. For Valentine's Day, yeah. Yo, for it, Valentine's it's Day, it's crazy. It's nothing, but I got a, uh, uh, like, a bottle, like just my name written all over it, and that I thought that was like dope. a henny bottle or something like yeah. that, like oh, personalized okay. yeah, or yeah, like yeah, yeah. from but, a person. That's yeah, pretty cool. Yeah, that is. Pretty that's dope. nice. Like, that's yeah, that's cool. what I'm saying. Took time to do something. And you guys. <sighs> Nothing. Nothing. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like, oh no, y'all got pussy. Bro. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, oh, okay. outside of pussy, like you know yeah. what I'm saying. Like, I thought she, I thought she meant outside of. But that. it also yeah, depends yeah. on the tone that you're setting before the holiday. Like, if that's your girl, girl, like your girlfriend, she should be getting you something for the holiday. But if that's not your girlfriend, it's like if you oh. didn't, if you didn't set yourself up to be like put in that position during the holidays and the holidays come around then you can't be expected. Uh, let me tell you right. how women get this is how they finesse the guys every every year. Be- when you start talking to them, yo, they you ask them about Valentine's Day, 
I go. I do the most for my man. If you my man, I'm gonna go all out. Bad times they get here. They just waiting for you to set everything the, up. No, like, no, they wearing the same know. lingerie they wore oh, yeah, the for lingerie. your birthday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now sometimes they do go out and buy some different lingerie. Like, but women also expect men to buy the lingerie for them to wear. For right. them, on Valentine's Day. Is this your true. certified girl? True. Like, is this your girl for sure right. that y'all have y'all not received? Like, have y'all been that single on Valentine's Day? Niggas? Y'all don't hear this from niggas? Like, we don't get shit. Yeah, this nah, this can't niggas. be nothing new to y'all. Like, I mean, y'all just agreed that Valentine's that's not, Day was that's a female's right. holiday. you should be getting something on Valentine's Day. I feel like... And we telling you, the only thing we get is pussy. The same pussy we got 365 days. No, I feel like at least paying for dinner. Like, going out to dinner and paying for dinner. Like, that should be a girl some ideas. Speak from a guy and tell him, like, the people who's watching this. What can you do for your man? Speaking for all men, yeah. what can they do? You go first to please you, you make for a Valentine's list. Give us Day. a list. Do your five things. You give five, you get ten. Listen, I, I, or three, I, five. Damn, that's a lot. Yeah, man. three. Okay, yeah. whatever you want. Um, I'll give y'all a list, even though I know y'all not going to listen, and y'all just going to do whatever y'all do anyway. <laughs> but you know, I do appreciate that solutions. We we try to deal with solutions over here. Mm-hmm. Um. Shit, uh, some cologne. Like, you, you, maybe you go to Macy's, get some cologne, That's some nice idea. cologne for, mm-hmm. like, on sale, like, some cologne. Mm-hmm. Um, You just making, like I said, reservations to go to a... It don't even got to be no five-star restaurant or some shit. Like, you just make some reservations. Um, they got shit on Groupon, guys. <laughs> Any, I don't know yet. Yeah, anything, niggas, but niggas, niggas they got stuff on Groupon. That. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Know. Anything to show that you actually are just as invested in this relationship as we are with y'all. Like, just anything. Like, you can write a card, a handwritten some. That's what I'm saying. It's really easy. A handwritten to, card, really babe. I love you. I appreciate everything you've done for me. Like, that, I, I would appreciate that. Y'all know I y'all not accepting no handwritten card, but go ahead. That's very. I want that a love has a lot letter. of meaning. Like I don't know. Those I'm, have a I'm, lot of meaning. Cards. I'm on my light school. skin. I'm on my light skin shit. It's 2022. Wanna, people can't even spell. Okay, well, I know how to read. Send me a text. Lane. You got to spell check mm-hmm. with your phone. Yeah. Right. That's oh, true. The, yo, real quick, the modern day version of a love letter is them writing on their stories, a long ass post, like you know what I'm saying. Right. I want my hand. Like, like, okay. I want my hand on the gram. I ain't really. Yeah, I ain't really big on that social media shit. But um, she um. I would like if like she planned a little something at the crib and gave me like a massage and we could have role role play or something like that. Like like I like shit like that. Oh she (laughs) Oh she planned something. Role play as what? Huh? Role play as what? So teach a student. That's what role play is about. Like you know what I mean? Like you know what I mean? Stuff like that. I didn't want to get too deep into that. (laughs) But um yeah, like I said, plan something where we go somewhere. Like, that's not New York. Get out the city for the weekend. Like, um, okay. you, you you said enough. Yeah, yeah, you I'm said gonna, enough. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm, I'm going like, say, yeah. all right, write, write me a love letter. Mm. Cook me a dinner or get something prepared without me. Because women can't decide what they want to eat. So every time I go out, I'm like, all right, where we going? Where we going? It was just like, damn, like, y'all what never you know. What you want to eat? I don't know. I don't like, know. Uh, what you want to eat? About the, so what about this restaurant? Nah, actually, I don't really like that. To like, actually have the idea where we're going to go and make the decision for once without annoying the shit out of me. And I'm going to go take that for some five, some orgy with five chicks. You know what I'm saying? What? If, no, Dan, you oh, that's what you want? That's too much. I mean, y'all said what I want, right? Okay. Like, okay. Like, okay. Like, yeah, you know, is this what your girl or? I, make it imaginary. Switch your outfits five times. Like, some, 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 <laughs> Put on some, a different wig up. and stuff. I don't know. Right. Like somebody I'm else. I'm not giving yeah. my man no threesome or for some. Uh, why, why not? Yeah, that's what Because that's table. for us. Like, that's how they like, for us. Like, if your oh, you girl. Oh, you ain't going to get Valentine's Day. No, Valentine's Day. Like, if your girl's bi, then okay. Like, that's fine. That's all you buy. But, yeah, I'm bi. But if she's not, if she's not bi. That then don't put that on her like she gotta give you a threesome or a foursome like that's pressuring her to do something she don't even want to do like, you, you know want now, it not her Valentine's Day is not for you just you guys it's for but love but still it doesn't matter if, if, she doesn't, up, if she doesn't feel comfortable with it, they say it's just for it's for everybody it's this the gesture of love if you yeah, look up what Valentine's exactly. Day is about you, do you love if me? You go even further back they said it was a day to celebrate fertility I'm you know where well technically like, Valentine's yeah. was a rapist I don't care if it's Valentine's Day or not if I don't want to give you that I'm not getting that on Valentine's Day Okay, mm. shaking my hand, stingy ass. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Jew, what, what are we talking about? All right, um, all right, my first topic is if you're talking to multiple, multiple people around Valentine's Day, how do you make your pick and what do you tell the other person? Whoever's applying that pressure around Valentine's Day. Yeah, I won't say that because I was a side girl one before without me even knowing. I got a little card or something. So guys are going to make their rounds, I think. What do you mean, oh. though? Like, they didn't tell you? No, I didn't know. I found out later that 
he had a girlfriend and I was the other girl. But uh, yeah, I mean, I got a little car. It was cute. I'm like, okay, cool. You got a little car. It was cute. Yeah. Like, all right. <laughs> did he take you out? Did he take why, you out national side, still... side chick day or whatever it is? Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, on the 15th. Yeah. Oh, Wait, he did? No, I don't oh, know. Right. Nah, I didn't know. Nah, you sound like you took a little personal. I'm like, yeah. oh. Yeah. 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 like the next day when they say, it's the day after. Yeah, it's either the day before the day after. Yeah, it was so long ago. I don't know, but yeah. Okay. Uh, um. Okay. Well, so you said whoever I mean, applying pressure. What about you? Yeah, like the person that's obviously like more consistent mm-hmm. out of everybody. During Valentine's Day or like, February. Yeah, just the whole lead up. Like not even during February. Like. But well, sometimes December, the most consistent person ain't the one that you feel in the most. Of. Well, whoever, and he might not ask you out. What happens no, if you don't ask you out? Whoever asks me out first and whoever has the best plan mm-hmm. is gonna. Oh, wait, you weigh your out. options. Oh, wait, I weigh better. my options because. Yeah. Like, I have people that if I'm talking to, they'll tell me, like, what they want to do. Like, I want to spend Valentine's Day with you. Like, I want to do this. I'm going to get you this. I'm going to get you that. What if he, like, I, I want to surprise you? I don't like surprises. I always tell people I don't then... like surprises. And sometimes I don't accept. Like, if we you just talking and he's like, okay, well, we about to do this, this, and that for Valentine's Day. We're going to go out to a nice dinner. Then we're going to do this. Then we're going to do that. I'm not accepting because I might not feel like giving you no pussy on Valentine's Day. If you not the one. That's what a new. That's what a new. So like a new no, person. you don't gotta be new. You don't gotta be old. Cause you, sometimes you could be new and get it on the first day, and sometimes you could be old and not get it after months. So depending who I see myself I like it. Keep it getting in the bed with mm. is more so who I'm going to pick. All right, yeah. Cause I, I'm gonna be honest with you. If I went on my way to plan all this shit, and I ain't saying it. I actually, you I'm get, saying, you like, get, you get, I need you to, should I be getting some ass. Yeah, I need to be able to secure some type of sex, like, because there's right. no way I'm doing all this shit. Like, you get what I'm but saying? For like, me, I mean, if you just I'm let him obviously go. gonna pick somebody I wouldn't mind having sex with. I don't. Why want you keep options. saying that? If what? whether I already had it already mm. or just in general, like for the first time, if I don't mind, then that's who I'll spend my Valentine's this Day with. I'm not gonna uh, spend it with no. somebody I wouldn't. What? Right. We'll, we'll I'm get to us. I'm a girl that's tired. I'm not cheating. I'm not messing around with different people. So the round thing, no. Mm. All right, so but what? But right. people talk to multiple people. Mm, That's right. not cheating. If right. you're talking to people, you're not in a relationship. You're not in a relationship. You're not in a relationship. Talking not to somebody. Cheating. It's about you picking. I think who as you a wanna... female, you're gonna have a favorite. You're gonna look to get something from me. If you don't care, about if you got a favorite, then why know. the hell are you entertaining another nigga? I'm it's no me, favorite. You said, you said while talking. Yeah, you know, that's what I'm you're gonna have somebody that you like. So what? What do you tell the other guy? What? That's no, like, I, 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 I want to take you out. Just don't say nothing to them. I don't want to celebrate. That's what you yeah, say. I, I got to work. They're definitely going to know. You said I don't want to celebrate. They nothing with me in the first place. Then that's what you said. Right. They, they me up are trying to plan something with you. Oh, they are? That's mm. what I said. It's two people. How do you make this? It depends. What are you trying to do for Valentine's Day? So, is it better than what he's trying to do? I'm so trying to take so you that's to what I'm saying. Which I'm one trying... is it? Can who's ever apply the most pressure or who's ever going to do the, the best one? Whoever's getting right, fucked cause... at the end of the who night. Who am I going to have the best time friend. with on Valentine's Day is going to win? <laughs> okay. I mean, uh-huh. okay. All right. But she uh, like, Imperial, wouldn't like, you nah, rather, you if you about, were a like... guy, wouldn't you rather spend your Valentine's Day with a girl that you know you're going to have the best time with? No, I want to fuck all of them. Okay. Right, so you just, everybody going to get next like, up. I mean, if I have multiple women that's trying to line up for Valentine's Day, I'm going to squeeze y'all all in. Nah. Wow. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Right. Maybe not the same day. That's who, okay, not the same day. Right. Yeah, not the same day. We talking about okay. Valentine's Day, We talking though, about the bro. specific day. And though. Valentine's Day work the whole weekend, bro. You, if you no, can't. No, bro. You, you, say, who tell, you, you definitely could tell her, listen, there's no reservations on Valentine's Day. We're going to go that Friday, whatever, however it goes. The day before. You got somebody the day of, it definitely And as a that's girl, what, you can say, as a, as, a girl, like, as a girl, it's easy to give excuses. You could be like, I have my period on Valentine's Day, let's celebrate the weekend. That don't mean nothing. No, Bro, yeah, niggas like red lights. Either. Some niggas like red right. lights. I'm not fucking with no nigga that want to fuck with me on Valentine's Day on my period. Like, that's really desperate. He it's said, yo, ain't that, yeah, ain't that the love, the day of love? That word, like, yo. He said Bloody Mary. <laughs> if you're my boyfriend, okay. Yeah, okay, oh yeah. You talk about niggas that you just date. Yeah. Okay, yeah, that's fair, that's fair, that's fair. I ain't running over lights. So right. Running over lights. Not even well, if that's your girl? Nope. No fun. Okay, I hit up. I've done it before, bro. This, yeah. this is Maybe the same nigga shower. that don't run red lights, but he eat ass. Like, so I don't understand, like, what the difference. Yeah, oh, my fault. I mean, yeah, you out like that, bro. My yeah. fault, my bro, fault. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, don't stop it, bro. Don't stop it. Release your secret weapon on Valentine's Day. Nigga said chocolate. Chocolate. In the shower, okay, but I'm not doing all that. No, nah, I don't got no. I, I could wait. Right, yeah, right. I ain't that it's, it's never that serious, wait. bro. You got you get face down. I call that head. You know. You said face down. But first yeah, of all, y'all scared of to do that. Like, I ain't gonna hold you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, real quick. Ju has this theory 
that black women do not like giving head. Like, what? I don't that know. Is not true. Oh, wow. That I would like facts. to attest to that. Well, I, I'm telling you, and not, every black you woman I ask on it, Maybe I'm Jamaican, so you bug it. Oh, wow. That's not true. That's not true. Just because I'm a black woman, I don't agree with that. I mean, don't say every black woman, because I'm a black woman. Don't say that. I enjoy doing that for my man. Yeah, I've been to my hair plenty of times. I hear a lot of black women complain because they got the stereotype of, you know, they don't want to be hearing niggas say, suck my dick from when they were younger, so they just never like sucking dick. No, that's stupid. I, that's, but, and I have numerous black women come on here and just like, yo, I don't do it like that. That's not true. I, I mean, the New I mean, Yorker every, in every, me. Every culture has a um a stigma. You get what I'm saying? Attached mm. to them. So it's fair that you're saying that, but. And the New Yorker in me, don't, don't, don't come to me like, yeah, suck my dick. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be offended. Yeah, no. If you ask, yo, I can I get some head? Like, I'm just saying. So like, got to ask you that, yo, can I please get some yeah. head? You don't have to you ask. Gotta ask. Yeah. You don't got to ask. Oh, yeah. But yeah. if you do, if you do, then you yeah. you say, can I get some head? You don't say, yeah, suck can my dick. Right. Sure so right that's heavy. So that's the proper way to ask for head? I mean, that's a little aggressive. What's wrong with a little aggression? I mean, see, that's what I'm saying. That's my nigga and we're already dealing with each other. He don't got to ask for that because that's not. I'm telling you, that always sound good. Y'all saying all the right things to well, say I, I before the relationship. But I, then when y'all get into the relationship, y'all be not saying all women, but some women just be quiet. I'd rather take care of my man by the giving same. head than having to do the whole, the whole everything. Right. But, I'd rather get rid of him and, and knock him out with just the head. You'd rather give head than fuck? Is yeah. what you're saying? Yeah. Whoa. Why? It's quicker. It's quick. It's quick. What mm. shit? <laughs> no, my joke Imperia, is less Imperia, work. what you got to say about this? What? I'm just taking it all in. It's, so, <laughs> so, so, it's less work for me. So like, in that, in that just, case, what's what's in it for you? Like you just like you just love giving head. Like, I, yeah, I, I actually it, like enjoy that though. God bless you. Okay. Oh my god. Yeah. Well, yeah, um, that's I, I, I never heard that I, I never really. I like rarely that. hear mm. black women advocate. Like they say they do it. They're not gonna say they don't do it, but they're not out here like yo. I enjoy it. I hear that from as every long other race. Right? Good yeah, hygiene. And she there's said no it's boundaries. Quicker, like I though. enjoy that. You just said, it, you said it's quicker, right? Yeah. Oh, that means you elite, huh? Right, right, let me oh, see. I, I, still like one, I still prefer the pooms, though. I, I, yeah, I can't yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm just saying, that. like, if if you're like sometimes is she, is she elite? when she you're in a relationship, like, I honestly like, forgot the question. I'm not gonna lie. I don't really have a high sex drive like that. So sometimes, but you bisexual and you don't got a high sex drive for men. And, oh, and not even a sense of I just don't have a high sex drive in general. But I'm just saying, like, when you're in a relationship, sometimes, like, a man is too needy for sex. And it could get annoying. So instead of just, like, you know, leaving him hanging, you give him head as long as he nuts. She's, she's going to be fine. She's still pleasing her man, though. Right. Oh, yeah. If you nut, what are you going to complain about if you're still nutting? You're going to nut. That's what I'm saying. Like, I'm going to make sure you nut. If she makes sure you nut, you ain't going to roll up like, thank you, no pussy. Nah, right. Gonna, you got to go to sleep that's and that's like. it. You can't fucking... Swindle me? Swindle me? What the fuck are you talking about you? <laughs> all right. Um, but y'all, y'all didn't also answer the question. Well, well I forgot if, the question. Like, if y'all talking to yeah, multiple people, deep, how yeah. how to uh how do you decide who you going with? And well, you, 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 you that, well, let me go first because yeah, you, yeah. you know I'm a very blunt person, so I just won't hit. You know me, I won't even hit the other person up. You're not a blunt. You like, ghost. You would go right. ghost. That's exactly. I, that's well, I'm ghosting. gonna be yeah, right, and I and I'm blunt. Like, and you, and he blocking yeah. it too. That's yeah. a lot of niggas though. Yeah, if I ain't fucking with you, a lot you of if you ain't make the cut, around certain houses. I know, I know who made the cut. Like, so if you ain't made the cut, why am I entertaining you? Like, that's how I feel personally. Mm. Like, I'm not gonna entertain you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, right, me uh, too. But I gotta know that you the, the the woman. Like, I'm not gonna lose my options, and right. I don't know you. You know, what I'm, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. What if you don't know yet? I'm gonna know. If I'm if I'm gonna invest that time knowing you, I'm making reservations. I'm doing all this shit, romantic shit. I I gotta know in my head that she don't she's gonna be the one that I'm gonna take seriously. I'm not doing all that. But what if it's only been a month, y'all? You've been talking to two shorties month, month and a half. You, you don't, you're not sure yet. I don't even think they're gonna get a Valentine's Day. I'm be honest, with you. especially like, if you, know you ain't fucked yet. Yeah, if, it, if it's been a month, like we ain't really, I ain't gonna. That's too more romantic. I feel like now, if we was talking for a couple of months, like Are you, you know what I'm saying? Kidding? Like, yeah, like no. we just started talking. Now uh, I gotta, now no. I gotta go out my way. Nah, uh, no. nah, ain't me. We gotta Man. talk. For a well, month. for me, it depends on how I feel about shorty. You know? I mean, if I'm really feeling the shorty, yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do something special for. Mm-hmm. for well, how you? What you gonna tell the other shorty? She. Yeah, I gotta work. I'm gonna see you. Tomorrow. And what no, level of special? What you should work. say is, mm-hmm. I'm a simple what level man. Of special take this card, you hand your card and out. If you feel Everybody feels uh-huh. special. It's like it's different. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Like, did you hit yet? Or no? Oh, I can't hear. Oh, um, all right. If I'm feeling her, like I, I feel like I could be in a relationship with her. That's what I mean. So you've hit already. When you talk you about special, no, but you can feel somebody without having sex. Listen, respectfully, if I did not hit yet. 
I'm not doing nothing for you. Really? Because mm-hmm. I could do, I could go all out, do a, a, a mm-hmm. the the expensive dinner, buy him something, cologne, whatever. Mm-hmm. You get down to the bedroom and, and it's trash. It's trash. Now I've you wasted could, my money. You could look at it like you mm-hmm. did something for a friend. Damn, what the like fuck spend, am I? Like you spent Valentine's Day with a friend. <laughs> 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 that wouldn't piss me off. Like if I actually P2P enjoy P2P your vibe me. genuinely, yeah. like I would just look at it differently. I would so just really change my perspective. Truly, I don't know completely if I could mess with a female until I have sex with her. Really? Yeah. It has to be. Because so, I, I could, I could be head over heels and then I hit and I'm like... Right. Yeah, that, that is true. That and is a female true. could be head over heels and be at the shrimp buffet. Let me ask what y'all. What you value. Hold on. Y'all, y'all don't have like an intuition where you know if... That, that's what I'm saying. I, you, you know I, what I can't Wait, if I know if the sex is going to be proper? Or? Yeah, you can pick up oh, on... You, nah. don't, you don't feel like you guys have that... Nah. Bro, anybody mm-hmm. could talk. You can read everybody, no, anybody could talk a good game. I'm talking right. about energy. You, somebody touch you the right I mean, way. You, you somebody, have that word. If you kiss them very, before, you know, a, a very few where you could kind of feel like, damn, I already know I might <laughs> like this person. Oh, no. nah, I can't I don't tell know. somebody I, I, gonna I, 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 be. You talking about if you could tell if they no, good I, and bad? I feel like you're maybe y'all need to hone in on energy a little bit more because you can kind of feel your chemistry with somebody. Chemistry and sexual chemistry. Yeah. Yeah. Talking about sexual but I'm saying, but it's a start though. But you can have if you don't feel like. Okay, I could probably engage with you. You have a connection with everybody, different people. Mm-hmm. By the level of intimacy and how far I can gauge you, and a dick I pic. can feel like, nah, not even. I could feel like if I'm gonna vibe with you yeah. in a more fluid way sexually, you but, can <clears throat> feel it a little bit, feel it out. Y'all talking about you're not so, gonna buy somebody a gift until you feel them. So, so, like, you, literally, so you're trying I to say that crazy. that you could tell. From a person's energy, if they're gonna be good and better, no, or not. that's not true. Yes. Is that the end of the day? Yeah? Even if yes. I get sexual energy Absolutely. from a guy, that's not gonna change the fact whether he got a small dick or a big dick. Like, right. No, but, and that's not gonna change the fact. You, big that, dick don't you got sexual good. energy as a female, gonna you either gonna have bad I box or good box. It don't matter what type of box. Yeah. Huh? Say that one more time. He's talking. What happened? Say that one more time. No, I said like you can have like a strong sexual energy as a as a woman, like if you're confident, but that's not gonna change the fact whether he likes. The box or not, like yeah, yeah, yeah. You it can't. might not, it might not like feel good to him in general, like the physical, I yeah, mean, not yeah, yeah. the not okay. the mental of it or the vibe of it. I it's had guys physically. talk to me because guys talk to me about sex, right? Mm-hmm. They tell me they seen girls that was very white. They come come to the mic. Come was, to the mic. Come. They to had the girls that was very white. They mm-hmm. had girls that was like medium. Mm-hmm. The girl that was medium was better than the girl that was very white. Right. If you compare my boxes, you'll say what is better, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But the bit who the female who know how to work her body mm. and have a better connection with him is a person he had a better sexual... <laughs> but, look, but did he know that from the start? He knew that because he experienced both boxes. He experienced like, both. No, but I'm saying, I, you saying it depends on the I, box. I, I, the, no, I also think that what thing. you're talking about is a mental connection. Like, I'm like a person that's kind of like that. Like, I like to... It's like, like, it's like, like foreplay. Like, mentally, like, you want to know that... that Fucking this person is gonna be amazing, or what they're gonna be doing. Let's say, like, you having a sexting conversation with this person, and what they, I mean, it could still not be what they promised, mm-hmm. but that mental part probably got you more aroused than what, what let me the physical. You, let me ask you a question Can you have great sex with somebody without having a mental connection first? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, yes, you definitely good. Of it's better when you got a mental okay, connection with them. Better, but, yeah. yeah, but you can get more intimate. It's more intimate. Call it pussy, like, wow. I mean her specifically, though, because the way you talking, it seems like you got to have that connection in order for it to be Maybe she's amazing, demisexual. Huh? Yeah. What, you a cancer girl? No. Who are you? Aquarius. My oh, that's why. Oh, oh, wow. Like, wow. We so like Aquarius. <laughs> My best friend is Aquarius. So, so that was yes? No? Or? What? Do I have to have like a mental? mental con- yeah, connection first. Yeah, to a certain extent, yeah. If I think you're corny, I'm, I'm, I don't give a yeah, fuck I'm how good fuck you. I mean, you, you know, you it might be corny immaculate. niggas could have some, like, you know right, what I'm saying? Right, it might like, be immaculate, be but problem, I just can't get past everything else. You know, yeah. Yeah. No, no, it's dude, a mental thing for real, though, yeah. I touch it you. is a, yo, y'all niggas acting like, I don't know about y'all, but mentally, like, my dick got a mind of his own. If it's yeah. some chick that I'm about to fuck, my dick will be like, yo, you think I'm fucking her? You on your own. You know what I'm saying? The nigga will leave me. But that's not, you know that's not saying? a mental like, connection. That's physical, that's physical. bro. No, but if you physically is, not jacked up, I don't up. like what she's doing or whatever else it is. But she bad, she, you're not gonna fuck. 
Yeah, but you it's might. Drop the cap, drop the cap, bro. Some people, because for real, like, if you don't really see eye to eye with the person, you don't really, like, agree with their mentality, you don't like their vibe or Bro, energy, if she definitely disrespects me, I'm definitely not slapping. Let me land the bed with them is not going to be the most comfortable situation. If you get to that point. Let me ask you a question. Have you guys had somebody who is great sexually, and then y'all fell out, and then you were just like, you know, I don't even want the person. The sex has kept me there. No, I'm but not honestly, no, like you just something about them, you, you just, you just turned off at, from them. A, a chick, if she got on your nerves or you wasn't fucking. No, with them like more? you really just don't fuck with them yeah. as a person. You wouldn't stop. And they had good her. sex. You said you're lying, bro. You would stop fucking a, a bro, chick. Bro, uh, can they talk for this though? Yeah, <laughs> like shit. <laughs> I, I, nah, and she, yeah. and she bad now, bro. Uh, I'm yeah. still gonna slap. Yeah, and then you're because you might. Yo, women be cha- yo, right women lie. Yo, yo, women will change. Yeah, women will change after they get the dick. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah, when yeah. I, that's when not I find annoying as she is. When I find the next one, she definitely cut off. But until then, I'm, yeah. I mean, it depends. That's like going to the club or wherever you go and you see somebody, and things escalate quickly. And I'm sure everybody has been there. Mm. Shit is escalating quickly before you know it, y'all both in the bed. Right. You don't know this person until you really get to know them a few days, a few weeks after, and you like, damn, this person is corny. But the sex. It's, it's keeping me there, just yeah, like the yeah. sex is keeping the a lot of yeah. a lot of people in toxic relationships because the sex, sex is good. Like, like, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, Amen. What, what uh, we talking about? For we real. Spe- what we talking right. about? Uh, my next topic is: if you're ready for a relationship, but the person that you're talking to isn't, if you, if you wait, how long? <laughs> how long do you wait? Yeah. I'm not waiting. Me neither. So if you're re- waiting, you're ready for a relationship, and they're not. You're not waiting because I'm the type of person. I don't like to jump into things too soon. So if I'm ready for a relationship, it's, it's been, been a, a reasonable, minute. like reasonable amount of time. Like what's a reasonable done, amount of time though? How about okay, like maybe like depending on how much the person has opened up to me, because some mm. people are more closed off initially mm. than others. But if that person is open from the beginning, it should take like four to five months to know if you want to be in a relationship with somebody. If you don't know by four or five months, mm-hmm. three, you, you don't know. You're not. You don't want to be with the person. Okay. If you don't see me mad, sad, happy, excited, all we've done been through all these different emotions and everything. We've been through all these well, different five months. You still put you up should a front, know. bro. Like you still, you yeah. still ain't, you still ain't revealed still, to, no, to but that should, other person. It doesn't matter because at the end of the day, even if you're with somebody for a year, they could still be putting up a front. People could be fake after yeah, five. That's days. what I'm saying. So, so why, rushing, why rush into a relationship? It doesn't matter months? if you get in a relationship for like after a year. That person could show their true colors year two. It's a risk you take. In they general. say you never really know a person until you, really you move in with them. Exactly. Right, you know, right. so. so if you're willing to take that risk, you should be willing to take that risk from dealing with them for at least four to five months. Mm. Like I'm a cancer. You got two weeks. Damn. You got two weeks. Like, we like, doing yeah. this or not? What's up? What's up? You don't know. Take that yeah. long. If it takes that long, you don't know what you want. And if you that confused about me, you don't need to I feel like that's why our relationship, yep. a lot of relationships fail because people are just rushing into relationships. You got to get to know people before you... you, you commit to this person like you okay, can't just be in the day you're never gonna fully get to know somebody if you're not giving them 100% in general but you ain't gonna fully get not, to know them in two weeks if you're not in a relationship with them you're not giving them 100% so you're never gonna really yeah. get to know them yeah anyway. two weeks I could put up the front just so I could get the pussy like you know what I'm saying then I could be some asshole nigga after well, like, you know what if I mean? the sex is good and we have a mutual agreement two weeks what's up Let's, let, let me know cause after two weeks or three weeks I mean after mm. the sex mm. let's say even a month you should know what's going on. We we, we, we we having sex multiple times a week. We going out to eat. I done right. met your mother. What's that's left? Damn, Besides in, a month? Title. In, in a month? That's a mess. Yeah. 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 That yeah. would yeah. scare me yeah. away, though. Yeah. Because yeah. I would be like, yo, you're on some BS. If I already met your mother, how many girls has met your mother? That's if I only met your mother Matter after a month? Realistically speaking, y'all don't feel like I want, even after, let's say, two months, Three months. You don't know if you want to rock with somebody or I'm not? A, I'm, I'm going to answer this question because men and women, I feel like because women have this biological clock, like they are more willing to, all right, let me hurry up and settle, settle down, produce, have these children, things of that nature, because I know my body, I'm getting older. I'm not, I might not be able to have kids as the same rate as I could when I was younger. So women, like you said, you might there might be more of an initiative for y'all to hurry up and want to be in a relationship. Front. Once when they hit 30. Yeah, like, it's like, I yo. I don't even think about the kids. I'm not The first day, yeah. How many kids you trying I, to have? Like, I don't yeah. think about that shit. I'm just thinking about my time in general. No, that's I'm true. Not but I'm not wasting my saying, time talking and talking and talking and talking and talking to you, like. Yeah, but I'm saying, but some women, they, they use that as a feel to like, all right, let me hurry up and expedite, like, this relationship. Mm-hmm. Guys, we just trying to take it 
you know, guys be trying to take it slow. Man. Make sure this is the right woman that I'm going to invest my resources, time, energy yeah, into. Yeah, but in that process mm-hmm. of being slow, you guys are being disrespectful. I, I oh, definitely. Because in that process of being slow, you feel like you don't have to be fully committed to her because you guys are not in a relationship. So you guys mm-hmm. are gonna always pull that card. We're not really in a relationship. We're not together. You're not my girlfriend. You're not my. That's you're him being real. Yeah, but he's up front with you. You act like yeah, he's but lying now to you're you. stalling and wasting my time. If you want to be single, be single. The fake. Women say women are fake all day. So you don't think we want to wait to see if you fake or not? But you're always gonna get a fake side of a woman if you're. All right, if, so that's why we're taking our goddamn time. <laughs> see the real. <laughs> no, I'm saying you're only you're always gonna get that fake side if you're not fully committing to her. Why is okay, she gonna so be real with you if you can't even right? give her full commitment? Let me ask you something. Being that they say got women are more ready, right? And guys, they you guys have this reputation of when you know, you know. Mm. Doesn't it just be up to y'all? Like you get what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, men have like, we men control access to relationships and marriage. Women control access to sex and childbirth. Like you know what I mean? Exactly. So y'all Double more y'all, y'all do have to wait on the men right. to so, be ready. Like you know what I mean? Like, 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 marriage and then the woman with the childbirth and what? Right and sex. Right. Y'all control access to childbirth and sex, and men control access to relationships and marriage. Y'all not getting down on one Men control access of 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 birth too. Well, for for a smart female, if a man says he doesn't, he He's not interested or into keeping that baby. As a smart female, you should not keep that. You, you should say, take heed of what he's saying. You but, have but, the but you got the so decision. So saying, you saying a lot uh, of women I mean, are dumb. Did you yeah, just violate yeah, the yeah. whole population? You women. still got the I mean, decision. Heard, did I say I women are dumb? Do no. Saying, you, say, you said a smart female. A lot, a lot of, of men is expressing to... A lot of men is oh, to women, y'all. I'm not ready to be a no. father. If they walk like a duck and talk like a duck, it's a duck. Why would you have a kid with... I mean, unless you... Unless you're okay with the fact of raising a kid on your own, that's different. Well, but if you're expecting households. somebody to help you with a kid, his opinion should matter no, too. I don't, I don't agree with that. Like having a kid against a man's will. A, man, a man's agree. will. 100%. Like, I don't agree what with that. Because if you're stuck thing. in a situation where you <laughs> have no baby daddy, you have more father in the life, that's on you because you still decide to keep the kid after he said he didn't want it. After all these toxic Scorpios we might be having in nine months. So, you know. All right. All right, well... Yo, <laughs> all right, let me just get into this um advice topic. So she like, like, yo, fuck the advice. What a Valentine's Day, the cho- chocolate, like you know what I'm saying, like it's a, it's a it's a relationship topic. That I mean, somebody sent us an email. He wants some advice. So basically, he's a 21 year old male. They're both 21. <laughs> um, they met back in high school. They've been together for a few years. Um. You would have got that paragraph. All right. <laughs> During that time period, they had a few arguments, but um, he found it weird that she never wanted to go out on dates, as if he was embarrassed to be seen in public with them, but they post each other on social media. Mm. Um, uh, after Valentine's Day, she started acting weird. Like, she don't call, she don't message, she don't FaceTime no more, and she loves to FaceTime. Um, he said every, the whole time he was together, he bought her everything she wanted, two Mac laptops that she broke within two months oh, wow. of each other, Apple Watches, yeah. et cetera, et cetera. Maybe her boyfriend broke. So now he <laughs> find out, he find out she, she cheated on him. There you go. And he, he can't prove it because she deleted messages and she claimed that the way that he loves her is toxic because he's suffocating her. And he, he admits he's a little clingy but he thought that's what she what she wanted what should mm. he do but he still wants to be with her what should he do he needs to move on he does <laughs> he you gotta move on. on that girl don't care about his feelings well oh he's what he's the other guy he's the other guy he's yeah. a side dude i still yeah. got the max bro i don't know how max bray oh. so yeah that's crazy <laughs> yo i ain't even thinking that that's crazy yeah. Okay. I mean, MacBooks and all that. If you, you, he buying you MacBooks, he going all out for you and you cheating, mm-hmm. you got to leave home. Let me ask you, you how long. Let me, let me, and move on. That's fair. Let me ask you a question. Do you feel like, um, because we always talk about how, women always talk about how they have been hurt by men and yada, yada, yada. Do y'all feel like men have been equally hurt by women as women have been hurt by men? I swear to God, y'all blame y'all fourth grade girlfriend on why y'all savages. I swear to God. Grade. Every guy says that. This, they this got their heart 21, broken. This nigga's 21 years like, old. He's 21 years old. Like, you know what I mean? Y'all high school girlfriend. You so always God. hear about that one girl. Who it up I think it's story. the exact opposite. Like, I don't know. Like, Hurt I mean, people hurt people. Yeah, it, it, it yeah. goes both ways. Like, 
Women mm-hmm. hold on to the, the nigga that she was paying his phone bill when he was 16. And then don't right. do nothing for the nigga that she married with. Oh, I right. did this for this man and da 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 And no, I'm not, I vow I would never do nothing for another dude. <laughs> right. Why the night? Yeah, that, that's what y'all be doing. <laughs> y'all really be what? But, like, ain't no, no, those people need therapy. And it, it, they don't have to go to, they don't have to go to, the, don't have to go to the doctor. They can go to, they, you can see it as, your, as the partner. You can say, you know, I see you have some trauma. What about what I'm doing or I'm presenting to you that's making you trigger? You get what I'm saying? So you have to kind of work with them because they trigger. They only mm-hmm. acting like that because they think they've seen it before, you know? So, so again, do y'all think men go through just as many traumatizing yeah. experiences yeah. as women? Like, I, feel women like, I feel like, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, I hate to get, you know, too deep or bring it too far back, but when a man has been hurt by his mother, or, you know, that leading female in his life, period, mm. he's going to act a mess mm. as far as relationship-wise. So he has may have never been hurt from a female he's been with because he's, he's too busy dogging. Right. No, I think a, a dude like that, which I'm a dude like that, I just expect the woman that I do date, I expect more from them. Got a little. No, not, I mean, not, I, I, not, I expect, not disrespectful, you, I expect you like to be similar to a mother, sister, friend. You got to have a little bit more for me. I'm, it might be asked for a lot, but I tell you this from, from jump. So mm-hmm. you ain't walking into no surprises. Right. And that's fair. You know what I mean? Cause you, I lacked it. To, yeah, yeah. But yeah, I'm yeah. willing to do what I'm, whatever I'm asking for, I'm willing to receive at the same right, time. Right. So. You mean you, you ready to get? Ready to get. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Gonna... Yeah. Me too. Right, yeah, let's get let, let's yeah, just finish this. There's a vice topic off real quick because I'll be sidetracking and she like, yo, what a Valentine's Day themes that like yo. Yeah, you you 21, bro. Um go live life, man. She clearly, yeah. she clearly Wait, who are we she, talking about? The the 21, 21, yeah, who girl's cheating. Okay. Like she clearly show you where she wanna be at, and that's in these streets. Ain't, that ain't with you. Like, <laughs> for, thing. Right. In these for the streets. streets like, yo, right. she asked, that ain't for One you, thing man. I always said was is is horrible to try to give somebody advice. Like, you know, you are only reiterating what they already know. A mm. person's going to leave when they're absolutely tired and at rock bottom and there's no place else to go but mm-hmm. up in an indifferent Certain direction. Mm. So yes, it's he wants affirmation. I think but it's we, totally we're, his we're, decision. Yeah, we're we're day. we're yeah. telling him the right thing. Yeah. What you think is exactly what's happening. But he's still gonna do what he wanna do. Right. right. That's true. Right. That's like and, when niggas tell That's him. like when niggas tell women to stop fucking with fuckboys, but y'all still fuck with the exactly. fuckboys. Like, you know they like, gotta feel, they gotta go through that yeah. hurt. You know, like I said, you're a product of your environment. Yeah. You know? Seeing toxic, you going you're gonna experience that and you're gonna continue to accept I would, it. I would tell him date around her. It's not right. cheating because he's not really in a healthy situation. Nah, gonna see this. Don't let her right. don't yeah. let her don't let her change you neither. Yeah, so yeah. don't let her be the 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 blueprint to you hating everything yeah. or everybody that mm-hmm. either looks like her. And yeah. based off the message, it seemed like he's giving her too much power. Right. And like sometimes when you give females too much power, they do abuse it. Like it gets mm. to their head, mm. and they feel like, oh, I got this this nigga wrapped around my finger, so I'm gonna play with him. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. I'm gonna tell you, don't be clean because they don't like that shit. Exactly. Even if they yeah. tell you they That's like that shit, true. they don't like that shit. That's they not like true. That. They like it from the right person. Right. If she don't like you, she don't like you. But right. if she actually likes you, she's going to want you to be on her body. Right. She probably just don't like him. Mm-hmm. But can't really tell him. Relationship at all. Him on, let him on too much. For three years? You yes. Tell, you give advice. What it look for like for you? Yes. She's going to lead somebody on for a long time. An uh, opportunist is that what you call it. crazy. I'm definitely telling her to kick Rocks. the bucket. Right. Yeah. Right here. But I'm saying he's simping. I don't know what it is, if it's his first serious relationship. Okay, as a yeah. female, have simping, y'all been though. in that situation where you are acting like the girl? What you mean? Like his girl. That's, Were you acting like that's her? eight out of ten girls. Were you acting like her ever before? Not when in a you relationship. Was, when you was receiving something from a guy, but you really wasn't. Definitely, but not in a but solid relationship. Right, but, 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 exactly. but why? Where, where, what emotions were you feeling? That you nothing. Didn't disclose nothing. Exactly. I didn't feel nothing. Right. So there you go. So please leave And he knows that, though. We're transparent about that on both but who, ends. Who says that in his eyes, they're in a relationship? In her eyes, people have fake social media pages. You know what I'm saying? What so the she hell never are you she she about? never posted him. She never did anything. Wait, no, they, they never posted him. No, they posted him. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, obviously but they're not being like transparent with, with each them. other. They're not being transparent. No, something. I think they are being transparent. But she knew how to manipulate him, and I'm gonna work him. So if a, me getting in a relationship with you is gonna allow me to get monetary things, which is my goal of what I'm trying to obtain. Yeah, but they don't. But if you're cheating, if you're cheating on him. 
and you're using him for monetary things, you're not being transparent. If he knows from the jump that he's That's tricking, what I'm he's being transparent. I'm saying, oh she yeah, she's not being transparent. Yeah, she's not being transparent. If I know him. all you need to is says, all I know is you need to be told we're together and be posted, and I'm gonna get everything that I need because I'm just that type of person. I then I won. I can't stand people that much. I'm so sorry. If I don't like you, please right. get out of my yeah, face. Right. I can't even fake it. Okay. I'm good like, on the He's probably being genuine on his end, but she's not being genuine on her end. Yeah, right. Sir. Yo, move that's on, bro. Leave you her. deserve better. Yeah, so more of the story is, you know, you deserve better, King. Like, you right. know what I mean? But anyway, we appreciate y'all pulling up, man. This was a dope episode. Yeah, yeah it was a um, great we time had, with you We had some great topics on here. And period. Yeah. Don't be oh, looking oh, at me oh, like oh, that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So um, anyway, let them know where they can follow y'all at again. You can follow me on Instagram at tikagal dot underscore, mm-hmm. and you can follow me at brown underscore thundercat. But don't please don't run in my inbox calling me brown thundercat. My name is on my profile, Raina. Brown thundercat. <laughs> brown skin and thunder. <laughs> Instagram imperial dot justine. Okay, okay. Okay. And anyway, we we appreciate y'all tuning in. If y'all got any agreements, disagreements, put them in the comments. Mm-hmm. Make sure y'all check out the merch, man. I got some merch on dailyrappercrew.com. And if y'all want to support, I know y'all be like, yo, we need more episodes. We work, we definitely working on it. I promise you. We need more, um, we need some support too. We got Cash App. If y'all want to donate, send us on our way to help us out. We definitely appreciate it. It's not necessary, but we appreciate it, man. Like, sure, send me a dollar. And tag my name on it. Well, what do everybody do outside of this? I carry events. Since we're talking about Instagram. Oh, you should have like plugged that in real quick. Right, Parties and stuff. Yeah. I um, work downtown at the Barclay Corporate on 41st Street on the 31st floor. Damn, that's it. Damn, like yeah, all of that. They're going you. Okay. That's like, it. Uh, okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> you want to disclose yeah. where you work, I guess? No, okay. okay. I mean, you got, you need to get ID to get in the building, but if you want to come and support and, you know, we can do that. So. Right, anyway, we appreciate y'all for pulling up, man. <laughs> Game is full. Cool. Thank Who you. Can you up right now? <laughs> <laughs>